A new baseball league coming to Central Georgia and is catering to those who may not have had the chance to play the game before. Avery Braxton talked to the league CEO and Avery joins us now in studio with more. Frank, that league is called Alternative Baseball. It's players, people with special needs, it's coaches, volunteers, and it's commissioner, a man a passionate about offering everyone the opportunity to just play ball. At age four, Taylor Duncan was diagnosed with autism. Well, I had a lot of speech issues, sensory issues, and anxiety issues when I was much, much younger. It kept him from one of his favorite things in the whole world, the game of baseball, thanks to coaches' misunderstandings of his ability. They deemed me an injury risk, so I was often put out from playing traditional baseball. Duncan didn't want to see that happen to anyone else, and in 2016, Woo! started his own league, Alternative Baseball, in Dallas, Georgia. Alternative Baseball provides an authentic baseball experience for teens and adults with autism and other special needs ages 15 and over. They play major league rules and use wood bats. The only exception, a bigger and slightly softer ball with emphasis on player independence. Recreating the entire Sandlot experience. The league is coming to Macon this fall. Former Bleckley County Royal, Georgia State Panther, and minor league St. Louis Cardinal Chase Raffield volunteered his services to coach. If, if you love the game, um, sports are for anyone. So uh, I think that taking baseball to them won't be a problem. I'm excited for the players to get to know them. Uh, we're going to grow together, so it, it'll be a blast. And Commissioner Duncan wants everyone to feel accepted for who they are on and off the diamond. We want more opportunities to be able to show what we can do, not what we can't, not what people think we can't become, but give us the opportunities. You may be surprised at what we can do. Now, Alternative Baseball already has teams in Columbus, Atlanta, Phoenix, Arizona, Auburn, Alabama, and over a dozen, a dozen, a dozen, excuse me, dozen other cities. Duncan said they have enough players signed up right now for about half a team. They're still looking for more players, for volunteers, and coaches. Frank, sounds like a home run to me. Yeah, I agree with that. Thanks, Avery. If you're interested in playing, coaching, or donating money or equipment to Alternative Baseball, you can find a link to this story on 13WMAZ.com.